Oh, hey, YouTube, Jim here. Welcome to Top 10 Archive. I'm a little chilly. I've been cleaning out my freezer and, well, there are no bodies in there, but I did find my mom's leftover fruitcake from Thanksgiving five years ago. No, I mean, really, this was some life-changing fruitcake. Couldn't let it go to waste. <laughs> well, anyway, that reminded me that there are instances of objects, artifacts, and even animals that have been frozen in time. So today, let's look at the 10 weirdest things found frozen in ice. Now, before we get started, and if you're new to the club, why not subscribe to the channel and click the bell for notifications of our future videos. Let us know whether you liked or disliked this video, and be sure to comment with your best ice pun. Number 10, frozen dinner. These men caught, so to speak, a gruesome scene that we'd happily watch on the Discovery Channel. While ice fishing in Indiana, a couple of brothers discovered the tail of a fish poking out of the ice. When they removed the block around the fish, they discovered another fish underneath trapped in its jaws. Do fish have jaws? <clears throat> well, anyway, this one sure had a lot of sharp teeth, which are seen through the ice around the bass's head. Apparently, the pike was viciously devouring it, choked, then were frozen in time together at that moment. Some think the pike choked and rose to the surface where it died. Others, <clears throat> okay, just me, think we need it above my fireplace as soon as possible. Number 9. Grasshopper Glacier Our number 9 seems like something out of Game of Thrones. Why? Well, only in some surreal, harsh winter reality is it normal for hundreds of thousands of grasshoppers to die in ice. All we need now is for them to defrost with super strength and take over. See, you would never think that insects have the power to take over something as large as a glacier, but you'd be mistaken. This glacier in Montana is actually named after the critters because inside its icy coverage, it holds millions of them. It's most likely that the swarm had been passing over when they got caught in a storm and frozen into the glacier. Number 8. Ancient Amoeba Diseases The melting of ice caps not only leads to the rise of our sea levels, which on its own is some day after tomorrow stuff, but also unleashes diseases that have been dormant for decades. It seems that diseases can be frozen in time under glaciers and then revived to take us all out generations later. Wow, as if we didn't have enough to worry about with the diseases that currently exist in our era. Now this! Years ago, they discovered a 30,000-year-old active deadly virus, nicknamed the Pathos virus, in the Siberian tundra. Though deadly and incurable, it's not actually going to affect humans. But one that could be is under the next glacier. Number 7. Anthrax A couple of years ago, the Yamal Peninsula in Siberia released a much more concerning disease after a strong heat wave. In 2016, the heat wave that hit Siberia released a reindeer that was previously covered by the ice. No, he didn't have a red nose, and no, he didn't get up and run away. In fact, it all sounds magical until you reach the part of the story where the creature had anthrax and released that to the public instead. Many local herds and at least 20 people were infected, and a 12-year-old boy died during the tragic incident. Number 6. Alien Markings Frozen lakes aren't just for ice fishing. They can also be utilized for strange alien messages. Really, though, it was just a couple of friends who stumbled upon a weird shape in Utah. The formations were under small holes in the ice and seemed like they were frozen into the lake, not marked on top of it. This led the two friends to the thought that it's alien markings. Others think it could be a previous landing spot of a UFO. Some even think the markings are eggs from another planet. Yeah, let's scramble those babies up. Now, more realistic theories involve coffee spills, salt used for ice fishing, and natural ice formations. What do you think it is? Number 5. Perfectly Preserved Human Nothing is scarier than finding a dead body. Okay, maybe finding a lot of dead bodies. But what if I told you that the body is perfectly preserved and super old? Is that more or less scary? She's actually an Incan girl in her early teens found at the edge of a volcano. When we say well-preserved, we mean everything was so intact that she still had lice. Not only was she wrapped in a sort of mummy cocoon, ice is basically formaldehyde on roids, so bodies don't end up shriveled and ugly, but very realistic instead. So much so that the researchers who worked with her body were on edge, 
feeling as if they were with a real-life person. It's hard to know what happened, but she tested positive for tuberculosis and suffered from other diseases, so she could have been sacrificed by her own tribe. The cause of death was a hard blow to the head. The discovery was actually named one of the world's top 10 discoveries by Time Magazine in 1995. She was also featured in National Geographic and taken all over the world to be exhibited. Number 4. Todd This find was recently made by 26-year-old Jaffer Sandström, who was hesitant himself as to whether skating on a lake in Jönköping was a good idea or not that day. He found something as frightening as it was beautiful, a frozen fox. He didn't recognize it at first, thinking it was some sort of frozen item. The whiskers, though, were a telltale sign that it was actually an animal. The fox looks like he's still swimming, frozen in place just under the top layer of the ice. It seems that the fox also went into the lake too confidently and fell through, unable to make it back out before freezing. An unfortunate ending for the fox, but a beautiful and impactful photo without a doubt. Number 3. A Mountain Range Antarctica, under all that ice, isn't flat at all like it looks like in all of our fantasies. The range is called Gambertsev Mountains and was discovered over a half a century ago. On top of that range is about a mile of ice, so it doesn't look like much to us. Underneath, you'll find peaks that reach up to 10,000 feet high that span over 750 miles. Now I need to drastically readjust the mental picture of Antarctica I had before. Like, can we build caves? Can we move there? Is this actually where Santa has the stash? Wait a minute, that's the Arctic. Anyway, scientists say these mountains have a similar appearance to the Alps and contain rock that dates back to up to 500 million years ago, or about the same time as the T-Rex was out wandering the Earth. Number 2. Utsi the Iceman If you haven't heard of Utsi, then you're behind on time, because he's pretty much a celebrity at this point. He's tattooed on Brad Pitt's body, Prime skin real estate there. So, who is he? Well, he was a fierce agriculturalist. And now he's in a cold storage system being preserved after he was found frozen solid in the Italian Alps by some hikers. When they saw him by a rock, they figured he was another hiker who died and had been there through the winter. Really, it was more like 53,000 winters. Scientists discovered that not only was Utsi thousands of years old, he was also full of useful information about ancient humans. Researchers found he was 45 years old, was suffering from a variety of diseases, including heart disease that until now doctors said was due to modern Western diets. They even found he had died by several encounters with enemies, having found he'd been shot with arrows and a gaping wound to his head that's likely the final blow. With him, they found a copper axe and other personal belongings. Number 1. Precious Jewels The only thing that would truly entice me to climb a freezing mountain would be with this climber's experience. In 2013, he approached law enforcement by handing over $250,000 worth in emeralds and other precious jewels that he found on Mount Blanc. Did someone just write the sequel to Anastasia? Hardly. The box holding the jewels actually fell from the sky during a plane crash in the 1960s. After the climber returned the jewels, two families claimed them as their own. The climber isn't the only one to find loot while climbing. Another Frenchman found 50 pieces of jewelry on the glacier in 2014. Thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe to the channel, click the bell to receive automatic notifications about new videos, give this video a like, and be sure to leave your comments down below. Hey, ready to comb the ice for treasures? Race you there!